So, feet, this is what we're gonna focus on. This space here, and frame it on this hip. So, elbows close to my body, forearm across his hips, wrist bone connect to his hip, right? Not above the joint, so you don't want your hands above. Uh, wrist bone connected to my wrist bone, which is connected to his hip bone, and my elbows connected. Right, so there's my frame. Uh, Foxy's hands are most likely on the mat, right? So here's my frame. The whole time here, I want, I want my elbows connected to my body. Um, now here's this space. See the space at my feet? I need to win. See how I elevate my hips? I, I bridge slightly. Step inside. Step inside. And once I get inside, if I just stay here, Foxy will win that space again. Especially on the side of the hip I'm framing on. So once I step inside, I'm gonna get that space close to my hips. So he's gonna try to get in that space, it's gonna be hard. And um, my knee, so, and look, here's one way he can get inside that space. He can bring his knee high uh, to the outside of my elbow and put it back inside, dig that foot back inside. Yeah, so I can monitor with my elbow on his knee. So if I feel his knee starts to go to the outside, I can block. Um, so what I wanna do is I wanna get my legs straight, same side as this hip. But if I just go from here, so I win the space at my ass, if I go straight, Foxy's foot will be underneath. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk toes here, toes here, toes here, yeah? From here, I'm not straightening where it is, I straighten back in the middle, here. So I'm gonna win that race. And if there's a hollow under my knee, so if my knee is pointing straight up, he's gonna dig his foot back in there and he's gonna win that space again. So, I go toes here, toes here, straighten in the middle and turn my knee down slightly. Now if you notice, my hip is up, but my shoulder, I'm not exposing my back, okay? Now same thing here, I'm gonna go toes, toes, toes. And what's happening is, I'm putting a little bit of pressure on Foxy's knee and there's gonna be a little bit of a space for my leg to come over and my heel to drag his knee inside, right? Or his foot inside. But he's gonna give me resistance there. So, toes. So either his knee comes off the mat to take off the pressure or his foot will get light. And most of the time it's gonna be his foot. This elbow has to stay connected to his knee. Now, before I step over, I'm gonna knee him up the hole. Right? And then I connect my heel to my knee, bring his foot inside. And again, I'm gonna close the space at my heel, put my toes on the mat. He's keeping this knee heavy now. He knows that I'm trying to do this escape. So it's called a knee elbow escape, okay? Because I connect my knee to my elbow. I use this foot on the mat, I scoop my hips underneath using this foot. So that unweights his knee. I'm using my hips to unweight his knee. And now I go knee elbow. I push with my elbow against his knee and I bring my knee to my elbow. His knee is inside. Uh, two feet are heavy on the mat, knees are pinched. If I hang around here, Fox is gonna take a cross face, push my knee down here with his right hand, I go back to where he was. So as soon as I get his knee inside, my feet are pinched together, my, my knees are pinched together, my feet is heavy, I'm gonna bridge and block the cross face. And now we're inside, into a half guard or into whatever position you like to get. Right. One more. Frame, elbows connected. Do this at home as well, if you want. We'll go.
Action. Voilà, action. Action, yeah, foot. So the foot's gonna go from his back. Big hip in. Is that the right time? Five past four? Yeah. That clock is good. We the power off since seven. Okay, action! Wait. Action! Wait. So here's, look, here's, here's the best side control escape you can do that a lot of people do in the gym. Are we action? Mm, no, we do it from this angle or do it from another angle? My foot is on his instep. Sometimes, if I'm flexible, I might be able to bring it in. But for most of us, we're not very flexible. And he's going to be keeping his right knee tight. I'm going to drive my right knee towards the window, okay, to move myself. And that allows my foot to come back inside. So my foot is now between his legs. So I move myself, I don't move him, watch. Action! Wait. Bonus content. Action! <laughs> Well, action. Action. Be taping. Action. Action. Wait. Action. Wait.